In view, a humble vaudevillian veteran cast vicariously as both villain and victim by the vicissitudes of fate. This visage, no mere veneer of vanity, is a vestige of the vox populi, now vacant, vanished. However, this valorous, valorous visitation of a bygone vexation stands vivified and has vowed to vanquish this venal and virulent vermin vanguard and vice and vouchsafing the vilely vicious and voracious violation of volition. Shing! Shing! <laughs> I do remember Natalie Portman's line afterwards. She was like, are you like a crazy person? <laughs> Some people wouldn't say that, yes. <laughs> I love V, I love him, I love him. I love what he said for. But yeah. <laughs> All right, so uh, we checked out Birbante. Doesn't look like they're hiring either. This is just, it's been such a very, very interesting situation. Like, you know, we're, I think I just, I'm just not gonna be successful, man. I think this is, uh, this is not it. We're gonna try something unorthodox. What we're gonna do, we're gonna uh, see if we could, <laughs> we're gonna look at, we're gonna try to gauge the, the value of an individual, right? Um, whether that be monetary or, uh, you know, other, otherwise. And we're just gonna ask if, uh, we're just gonna ask them if they're hiring or that they, they know someone that uh, needs uh, something done. So we're just gonna we're just gonna do that. That's, uh, that's what we're gonna get into. Interesting day so far. We've been uh, going around looking for jobs. Uh, we haven't given out any of the ten resumes that we've brought with us. Um, but <laughs> uh, we're hearing the same answer basically. Uh, you know, this is not the season. Oh, next season probably. Oh, summer season, which starts later. Oh, probably. Oh, I'm from Venezuela. That's exactly the uh, the pattern of our conversation. That's how they went. The future is looking very bleak. <laughs> the future is looking very bleak. I also do understand that a lot of what we feel, or if, if anything, the majority of what we feel is all in the mind. So um, I am a little nervous, uh, not because of the, the possible results, but of just, the, just in general, just like, uh, well, how am I gonna get money? You know, how am I gonna do things? So, uh, we're going to uh, understand that it's just a mind thing, it's just a mental thing, and then move on from there. How are you? What's your name? Um, I have a question. Listen, I'm not trying to solicit any service of any sort. I am looking for work, however. Um, I do have a whole repertoire of skills, and I'm just trying to, uh, maybe, do you... I'm looking for work too, buddy. All right, so we're in the same boat. <laughs> we're about to be in the same boat, literally. Well, almost, almost on a boat, with the same dock. Right, the same dock. Okay, that's, that's a start. That's a start. From the south. Okay, what part? Are you Charleston, South Carolina? South, South Carolina, yes, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, what do you, what kind of professional work do you do? No, nothing crazy. I mean, for the most part, I've been are serving. Are you an engineer? Are you an artist? Are you a... I, uh, I have a... Search, I serve a can't dance or crap. Actually, that's debatable. <laughs> Look at that video, the, the Colombian rooftop party. You'll see that I, that is contrary. We just had a long talk about uh, possible uh, avenues of work, such as swapping uh, electric batteries for cars, right? Like, a, you know, I guess swapping them out or charging them. Apparently, it's incredibly lucrative. I was listening to the whole, like, rhetoric, because there's, like, this prevalent thing of us, like, stick to the traditions, you know, stay with diesel. But then uh, apparently that's it's not that's not even a, a prevalent thing. You know, people are buying a lot of electric cars. So um, yeah, he's saying that the business is lucrative now and it's going to continue to grow and be even more lucrative. Now we're going to head to uh, the city and we're going to try to get ourselves into uh, even more trouble. Like, comment, subscribe. You know, somebody does diesel on foot. You know what I'm saying? On foot. Uh, we just uh, premiered a little while ago the Colombian rooftop party club. Currently, have one view. Put <laughs> on it. One view on our rooftop party club. Things are looking bleak. That's going to be the word of the day. Things are looking extremely bleak. You can't have the victim mindset. I think we got to be at a way. Victim mindset or what do you call it? A victor's mindset. Are we gonna play the victim? Uh, you know, we're just a uh, victim of circumstance, the job market sucks, there's no way we can find a job because no one's finding a job. Or, contrasting it, the victor's mindset. We can't get a job because we, we're supposed to get one because we have a good attitude and we can work well and provide that value to whatever. We're gonna try to walk around with a victor's mindset and hopefully we get something. Let's see what happens. We're gonna head to 34th 
24th Street now. And um, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Thanks again. Uh, so we're gonna head around see if we could uh, find some work, man. That's, that's the plan. We're gonna see if we can find some work. You guys are a sneak peek of what we're looking at right here. United Nations building over there on the left. Like I said, man, it's a whole bunch of foreigners going in a very beautiful building, talking about nothing, solving nothing, <laughs> absolutely nothing. It is a pretty building though, I'm not gonna lie. I haven't been inside of it, but I'm, I'm sure it's even much prettier inside. We're getting all the useless emails today, <laughs> including the ones in the beginning of the day where we're given a uh, very eloquently uh, put rejections, <laughs> rejection letters. Uh, that's where we're at, we're on 35th Street and uh, Tunnel Exit Street. We're still gonna try restaurants for sure. I think that maybe, because at the end of the day, there's no way that all restaurants can't be busy, right? All restaurants everywhere. There has to be some restaurants that are in areas that aren't so busy and then vice versa for other restaurants. So we're gonna check that out. We're in a pretty good area, I think. Look at this, Ted's. We might check that out. Be right back, you guys. Well, that place that we, that we were going to wasn't open. So we're gonna keep going until we find something. Uh, we can go across the street. We have a couple seconds. Oh, there's a lot of All right. Um, Look at these places. So we're gonna give these a try. Ziggle food. That's uh, I'll be right back. Let's give it a try. All right, no luck. Uh, maybe no luck. We, they are hiring in three weeks. Maybe in three weeks I wouldn't. I wouldn't even be here. Maybe I wouldn't. I'll be dead in three weeks. Who knows? This one looks pretty interesting. I might check this place out. Little Alley, they call it. All right, we'll zoom back in. So we just left the the little alley. Uh, it was literally called out Little Alley. Not, it wasn't a corridor or any sort. Not looking for anyone, so we're gonna continue walking. We can't give up, right? Maybe this is, uh, maybe this whole, uh, the whole sequence of events that happened today was a ploy to get me out of the house to uh, walk around for a little bit with no seeming, uh, with no seeming positive results. Hello, sir. How are you? I have a crazy question. Nothing wild. I'm not going to interview you or anything. Um, are you looking for uh, help or of any sort? No. Any personal assistant or anything? No. Sorry. Fair enough. Thank you. No, no go on our on our first uh, our first victim. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not, I have to like raise my hand. I have to sort of like show that you know I I don't mean any harm. You know, he's not looking for help. <laughs> So we're gonna we're gonna continue forward. Oop, this guy is going really fast. It's an Irish pub on that side. I think we should go back and give it a go. We gotta get it. <laughs> we gotta get it on camera. It's tough, man. It's tough. Can we get work? <laughs> can can Sobra get work? Let's let's keep going. All right. So we went in. Uh, we didn't. <laughs> no luck. <laughs> Not at all. It was so fun. It was so fun. We went in. We heard a. Uh, what was it? It's a. I think an old Elton John song. In the middle of the night, in the middle of the night, I'll be walking in my sleep. I'll be walking in my sleep through the valley of something. Even though we uh, we got a negative response in terms of employment, we we have rekindled an old memory. So I haven't heard that song in years. Restaurant right here, Wagga Mama. I think you have to like go online and uh, apply and whatnot. But we're gonna keep walking. We're gonna keep walking. What is the name of that song? You know? I know it's Elton John for sure. I just don't remember the the name of that song. Indulgent AF as fungi. Look at that. So it's yet another alternative. <laughs> no, uh, it's not soy, it's not rice, it's not al almond, it's not cashew milk. It is fungi. If you want fungi based yogurt, um, uh, I, I didn't even see the brand name, so. We've only given out one resume so far, but we have talked to a whole plethora of people. We've talked to a whole group. There's a place sin igual, sin igual, without the same. And it's a Mexican cuisine. So maybe we'll do well there. We're gonna check it out. 
I don't know. Without without the same, I don't. That doesn't mean that. I think. Maybe I'll get extra points that I know Spanish, right? All right, let's give it a go. We'll be right back. All right, so we just left uh, Cinewad. Uh, oh no, 42nd Street is a busy mess. I'm gonna go up 41st. So we just left uh, Cinewad. They're not looking for anybody. Um, so yeah, <laughs> that's uh, very interesting. There's a Korean grill there. Life is tough. Oh, look at this place. We're gonna try this out. Alberto, that's what they call it, Alberto. All right, so uh, we just left uh, this place. They uh, they are looking for servers and bartenders, but and Victor's mindset, Victor's mindset. <laughs> so we left a resume behind, and we're gonna see. Maybe they'll call us, and then we'll uh, carry on. Lexington Avenue. Lexington is not even a real word. You can't include Lexington in your lexicon, only unless you're directly referring to Lexington as in like the name of a place that's named Lexington. <laughs> We're gonna press forth. We're gonna see what happens. Victor's mindset. Victor's mindset, of course. Oh, so this is 101 Park. Meet up. Okay, so I was here during college. There was a guy that uh, we were, we had a project for one of our business classes and we were supposed to talk about this, uh, this book, I think. I think his name is Katzenbach or something. Last name of the guy, the, the author of the book that my group was meant to do the project on. Come to find out that this guy is actually, wasn't retired and he actually still worked. And he works in this location, 101 Park. So I decided that in order to do really well in our project, to come here and interview him directly. Um, and we were, I was so close. I could have died. I was so close on doing it. I didn't have any questions planned. I just came with a you know, positive attitude and uh, an eagerness to interview. But he said, you know, everything that you want to actually talk to me about, you can find in the book. So uh, it sucked. So close. It would have been actually pretty cool. Stout. All right. Let's see if they're looking for people. Be back. We're back. We're back. Um, Sombra del Piso. <laughs> Victor mindset. So we went in the stout. Um, they're not hiring at that location. They're hiring at another location. <laughs> they're probably hiring at another location. So maybe we're going to be lucky. How you doing, man? What's up? What's up? I'm good. I'm good. Uh, he looked like he's probably looking for work too. We're all looking for work, man. It's tough out here. It's tough. It's so tough. All right, we got a place here, uh, a Mediterranean spot. Can't be too difficult. Let's uh, let's go inside. All right, no, I didn't even give it a go. I just left instantly. It just it just looks a little dead, and it, it, you have to you know buy like a, a dress shirt to sell Mediterranean food, which doesn't have as much as a yield as uh, steakhouses and whatnot. We're going forward, going forward. We're gonna see what they got on uh, Lexington. They got a lot of probably fast food places, a lot of franchises, i.e. a lot of spots that don't have many, uh, they don't tip out their employees. So if we go there, just know every, all the time that we spend in school, it's going to be for naught. Even though you're, you know, at a restaurant that tips out their, their employees, you're going into the same situation, but uh, that, that's at least more uh, acceptable than literally just standing around and getting paid by the hour. We got uh, two uh, franchises over there. We got Cava, we got Chipotle, Dunkin' Donuts here. Fuel to continue their work. It's a mulligan's pub. You know, if you want to like sort of do, I want to do a mulligan in my life right now. You know, just sort of put all my cards in, give up and then restart. Hopefully not restart. Maybe go in a different, a different area. But uh, we're going to give this a go. We're going to go in, see if we can uh, give in our resume and then Check it out. <laughs> Another bus. They're not looking for anybody. Um, just playing like that. Looking for work too? Yeah, yeah same here, man. Good luck. Good luck. <laughs> so yeah, the guy that we, we said hi to a little while back, you know, he's also looking for work. That which is what I thought. I would like to say in a year from now, and I'm gonna be looking back at this moment and laughing hysterically. That's what I think. Um, so we're gonna head, we're heading down Madison right now. Uh, we got like eight resumes in here, and we're just gonna we're just gonna keep moving forward. 
Oh, look at this place. All right, Zuma. So we're gonna give this a try. Maybe they're they're looking for people. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. The time is now uh, sometime in the day. Three o'clock. Uh, we're still looking for work. We're in the city, Manhattan, Midtown, right? La, la, el, la media de la ciudad, right? Do we have work? We are sin trabajo. We are without work. We are not. We don't have anything. We uh, didn't give up a resume, but we do have an acute <laughs> gaining a, a little collection of. Uh, business cards we're not doing well <laughs> we're not we're not doing well we don't have anything that's like a sure shot you know something you know work this place looks good yeah it's looking a little empty we're gonna keep going <laughs> we just came from mad dog <laughs> you guessed it somebody del piso doesn't have a job still yay <laughs> you know what this is this is definitely like what i'm doing online you know with sending out hordes of resumes and applications but i'm not getting i'm just getting rejections rejections rejection letters rejections rejections except now um, um i'm getting the rejection sort of instantly and uh i'm doing like a little cardio right leg day so we're currently on fifth avenue the world famous fifth avenue with a whole bunch of overpriced stores so you would think guys you know you guys are not from new york and whatnot you think oh you know it's good let's go to 42nd street right go find a restaurant there you think that that's a logical option but it's really not just because uh the restaurants there you know are gonna be full to the brim with tourists and tourists don't really tip well so of course okay maybe you could uh, i can go for a volume thing right just get a lot of tips a lot of bad tips and eventually i'll add up to something significant but just i don't know it just might be a well if, iffy situation uh, we're passing by a lot of uh, the other guys that are also looking for work it's it's tough out here let me tell you it's tough out here i'm better off that's why online is better this is why all these social mediums have gotten so popular is because it's just much more effective to do these things that way you know look for work and all that another irish pub those things you have like the same crowd you know Oh, caca, let's check this out. Sorry. All right. Here we are. All right, wish me luck. <laughs> we'll see. Victor Mindset. Right, right. So, uh, we just left uh, that place, Takaye. It wasn't Takaye, it was actually somewhere else. But, um, oh, we could try this place. Let's try Kaye now. Give me one second. All right, so, uh, we're back. So basically, yeah, we just went to two places. It was the first place. Um, it was like a hotel restaurant. And those things, they never really get busy. But um, they got open spaces only because, uh, you know, I'm guessing not pe people don't want to really work there. It's not very busy. <sighs> Victor's mindset. We're going to carry on. We uh, not, Our situation didn't really change, really, from the beginning of the day, except... We are a couple uh, pieces of paper uh, poor. <laughs> All right, let's check this out. Parker and Quinn, we'll be right back. Oh, hello there, didn't see you there. We went to this place. Um, they're not necessarily looking for anybody, but we did collect an email that we can send our resume to. Uh, we currently on 6th Ave. Uh, let's move forward, man. I'm gonna go to the west, let's do it. Victor's mindset, Victor's mindset. We're gonna find something, man. We're gonna find something. For sure. Oh, look, there's another stout. I was just there. Okay, since we're on another stout, we're gonna go check that place out. Let's see if uh, we have any better luck with this one. So let's go in. I'll be right back. So we went to the second stout location and they told us that another location is hiring. So we've been, uh, <laughs> we're just trying to see uh, if that location is actually gonna be hiring. I am hungry, I am hungry. Hi, I'm hungry. And when I'm not hungry, I'm usually eating, going through uh, all this, the motions of the systems of the body in order to reach that state once again. If you want to solve that, please contact 1-800-DEATH, where upon death, upon meeting death, succession of all systems of the body will happen immediately and you will never feel hunger you will never feel pain because you won't have a digestive system nor will you have a nervous system in order to feel pain with 
So when you are ready to be absolved from the pain of hunger, just dial 1-800-DEATH. Do -do -do. <laughs> do -do -do -do. We're about to pass uh, Herald Square, or we're about to roll up on Herald Square right now. We just uh, passed Madison Square Garden, which is where uh, the New York Knicks play. We just came out of a restaurant. We, uh, maybe they're looking for bartenders. I'll take anything, I'll take anything. Um, so here's the other stout. So we're gonna go in here and then we're gonna see if we can get any more luck with um, getting a job. Let's go in, I'll see you guys in the next. All right, right. So we went to uh, Stout, this, uh, the final location. Um, we uh, saw an application and an interview later. We're basically gonna start training on Monday. Naturally, I know all this stuff, beers, drinks. This is gonna be easy. The thing is, we gotta start again, we gotta study. Uh, I don't think the food stuff should be uh, that hard to, to tackle. However, you know, we are starting from scratch. So we gotta build rapport and uh, build our savings and all that good stuff. You gotta love it, you gotta love it. Anyway, um, now the reason why we're in Old Navy is because we gotta find a tan shirt for work. Hi, how are you? Um, a little, I, I'm looking for a tan shirt, a tan t-shirt. That'll fit me, probably like in a medium. Um, does it matter if it has like... No, I gotta be like clean, like, you know, no logos. Is this tan to you? A little, I gotta be a little darker. Is it a tad bit dark? I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, no, don't worry. You know what? That, yeah, what's that? That one looks good. You're the best, thank you. No problem. Thank you. I mean, if you get two or more, they're $9 each, and then one is like 14 I think. Okay, so you know what? I'll probably get... I can get any other style though, right? Yeah. Okay, so let me see. I'm gonna probably get a different color. We got two shirts. Uh, both in the same tan family. Um, but, you know, obviously they're of different shades. So this is probably gonna be um, our new spot for the... Uh, for the next couple months, right? Considering that we're gonna have to start working here and whatnot. Uh, I mean, it's something, man, I guess. I, I, I mean, I don't know, man. I guess I have to just, maybe work will just keep me on the, the straight and narrow. Maybe it'll just make it better. We'll see what happens, man. We'll see what happens. I just wish I'd be moving vertically. This is just another, another lateral position job, you know? I'm not gonna go anywhere. I, I'll spend years at this place and nothing will happen. Like, I can become a manager. Ooh. That means I would have to put more time, and it's completely antithetical to what I'm trying to do. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, down, down, down. We could uh, make this video a get a job speed run. <laughs> uh, but it only took us like a couple hours. All right, here's the train. We're gonna go this way. So, um, yeah, I guess we could name this uh, Get a Job Speed Run. Uh, which we, uh, <laughs> I'm sure someone definitely could have beaten this already, or I'm not even close setting a significant record. But. I'm supposed to come in on Monday. 10:30 because Sunday, which was the day that I could have showed up, it was too busy. Anyway, we're gonna do that. It should be interesting. It's just work. Remember, it's just work. We gotta remember that it's just a means to an end. It's gonna fund our uh, our requirements, our wants. Uh, anyway, I guess that's the end of the video. We got a job, but most likely I'm gonna get the job because I know everything. Um, so we got the job. So. <laughs> and I'm not excited, which I knew was gonna happen, but anyway, like, comment, subscribe, uh, share this video with some peers. Uh, this is what we're dealing with. Okay. Like, comment, subscribe, uh, share the video with some peers, join the Discord server, please, La Liga de Sombras. Um, the link is gonna be in the description below. I keep saying the description is gonna be in the link below. No, the link is gonna be in the description below. As always, Stay radiant. Don't, get this, don't let this world get you down. It sucks, but definitely doable. Definitely livable. Manageable. So, peace. I'll see you guys in the next one.